Hello everyone! Uh, I know some of you may have watched my previous video about the Virgin Mobile scam, but for those of you who haven't, this is how to fix your null IMEI number for Samsung Galaxy Ace phones, as well as the no service signal. So, firstly you're going to open your phone dialer like you were going to dial a phone number, and you're going to type in star pound zero six pound, and this is to view your IMEI number on the phone dialer, so sh you should get a little box that pops up and it gives you a number. Now if it says null, this means that the phone settings just need to be adjusted. It's very simple. So we're going to open the dialer again. You're going to enter star pound 197328640 pound. This will bring you into the service mode. Okay, so now we're going to click on common, which is option number six, and then we're going to click on FTM, which is option number one. Now, if the FTM setting is on, you want to turn it off. This will restore the IMEI number and give you a bin file back into your EFS folder. Click the menu key, which is the bottom left of the phone. Okay, do not click the back key on your phone because this will actually take you out of the dialer. So click the menu key, then you're going to click key input and enter the option you want. In this case, you want to turn it off, so you're going to hit option two. So this will take a minute. Just wait and then it will change FTM to off. Now remove your SIM card. So take the back of your phone, either remove your battery if the SIM card's underneath or just slip out the SIM card. <clears throat> now you're going to restart your phone. Do not restart your phone with the SIM card in it because the phone will just continue to restart and nothing will happen. So make sure your SIM card's out, restart your phone. Once it has loaded back up, you should see the no service signal is gone and to enter your SIM. Okay, but wait, don't do that yet. The SIM card will not be able to read. First, you must open the dialer again and enter the service mode again. So click into the dialer and dial the service number, which is star pound one nine seven three two eight six four zero pound. Now, you're going to click on the debug screen, which is option number one. Then you're going to click on phone control, which is option number eight. Then you're going to click on NAS control, which is option number three. And then you're going to click on RRC HSDPA control, which is option number five. And then you're going to click change RRC revision, which is option number two. Now, you're going to click on whichever release your phone is. So for example, my phone is the Samsung Galaxy Ace 2X, which is HSDPA. So I clicked option two, release five HSDPA only. Make sure it has been selected by going back and clicking display RRC revision, which is option number one. Now you can restart your phone, then you're going to slip back in your SIM card and it should read right away. If not, insert your SIM card and restart the phone with the SIM card in it and it shouldn't restart over and over again. So there you go, problem solved. You've returned your IMEI number and your no service signal is gone. Just so you know as well, this also works on phones that have been flashed with new ROMs or stock ROMs and even if you haven't backed up your IMEI or your EFS folders. So now that you know that, Go ahead and give it a try. However, I will not be responsible if you make a mistake and break your phone. But hopefully this will help you. I know it worked for me. And thank you for watching.